Hello and welcome to the weigh-in for Fight Camp. We're nearly there. Eddie Hearn joins us again. Shalom, and, uh, motherfuckers! <laughs> apologies, we are, we are live, yeah. Apologies for that. Uh, apologies for oh language if you're watching that. Uh, Eddie. Hearn! 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 Fucking this and he's done that and he's done that and he's done that and... Oh, you'd rather molest me, you dirty bastard. I said, he said that I could suck his nuts one by one. Well, I'm not really into hairy nuts or nuts at all, but... How you doing, aren't Yeah. Good? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Mm. Yeah, mate, he's, he's a bit of a helmet, to be honest with you, but... Um, listen, he ain't a bad... Oh, no. First time I've seen you do it was Joshua's feet. Go on, son. Go on, son. Go on, son. Go on, son. You know. <laughs> Do me a favor. Suck my nuts. You're a knob. <laughs> bossy. Bossy. And then they get rid of Bossy. Jeez. Are you up for the test? Because I know I'm the best. Waste of time. Wasting my life. Wasting. What about all the talks you're having? Oh, because the. Uh, uh, maybe he's just saying it. I don't know. But if that's what he really thinks, please don't waste my fucking time. I'm really fucking busy. You know? So. Just, I'm busy. I'm busy. No time for time wasters. Give me someone that wants to fight. Joshua. Not talk about it. To try and raise their profile. There's only one. Deontay what? Bronze but Fuck it now, mate. You're the only person that says that. What are you laughing at? <laughs> Sorry. There's only one. Deontay Wilder. Yeah, there is only one Deontay Wilder. No one knows who he fucking is. Um, just finally, just mm. to finish off, next weekend, Sky's have got mad boxing on. Fr mad boxing? Mad boxing. It's like a proper pen team. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yo, Deontay, it's your boy, Eddie Hearn. Listen, I see you calling out all my fighters last night on Instagram. You started talking about Bell, you having no bite. You started talking about Dylan White as a spare tire. You were even calling out the champ, AJ. Let me tell you something now. You wanted to fight Tony Bell, you. You know why? Because he's a cruiserweight. I offered you the mills, baby, to fight Deontay, to fight Dylan White. You said, no, what do I get from that fight? I'll tell you what you get from that fight, baby. You get the profile. You get the Benjamins, you get the, the O's in the bank account, but no, you want to call out a fight you know can't happen. You know the IBF, the WBA, they said, no unifications, baby. So I'll tell you this, don't run your mouth to fight the champ when you got to be in some real fights, baby. You a good guy, you a great fighter, but who you fault, baby? Who you fault? Well, let me tell you now. Bell, you ain't fighting you. He told me, you know that Wilder, he's a big motherfucker. Okay? So, Dylan White, he ready to fight you. Why you don't want to take $4 million, baby, to fight the body snatcher? It's only the body snatcher. You know we're going to take care of Pulev, Ortiz. And then, if you still there, if you still got that beautiful green and gold belt, we coming for you, baby. You know I got all love for you, Deontay. But let's get this done. Thank you. Hey, Something like that. Check the money at the camera. Yo, and we got the money for you, Deontay. Yeah, we got the bench. When you start hearing people like that say things like that, that gives me a fucking hard on. I love it. In fact, it makes me really horny. The backlash makes me horny. 
Don't touch God, Jim. Yesterday's news, out the way, excuse me, we're coming in. So you're going to go, or, and we're going to go, shoo. So this could possibly be my greatest David Brent moment. Two profiles. Shoo. Or, shoo. But either way, see that? Army, two, two, army. Don't forget, pay your tax. Let's just hold on. No, oh, I'm not having this. I'm what, not having what, this. What, no, 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 no. Are you even? What? What are you even doing? Standing up. Why are you standing up? Listen, we come a long way. We have. Don Hanioni. <laughs> <laughs> This is... Hello? Oh, what's up? <laughs> Make your fucking mind up. What do you want, you silly toss pot? Fucking hell, I can't stand it. Hope you get hit by a bus today, you fucking wanker. And he lays there every night and he looks at me and he goes, you bastard, Hearn, but cool, you're a sexy geezer. Because you're sitting at home in your Transformers pyjamas. Knocking one out with your KY or whatever you use. I mean, you know, other substances are available. Are Where's that T-shirt from? What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh my God, I feel terrible. I feel terrible that I'm living in your red rent free. He's a bit tubby, isn't he? I'm a bit tubby. Not a bit tubby. It's not. People pick up words that you use. Like next week, Hearn says Ruiz is tubby. Well, obviously, he's fucking tubby, isn't he? I mean, when you have to put your shorts on, people see the truth. He's a little bit tubby. Yeah. Listen, when I go on the on the beach and put the old swim shorts on, I'm a bit fucking tubby. Let's be honest. I mean, there aren't people looking at me going up and down, down the beach going, oh, look at Hearn. He's a machine. He's absolutely cut to shreds. They're going, that's that Eddie Hearn. He's a bit tubby, isn't he? So I'm just being honest. We both started in boxing at the same time, yeah? And what I love about you is, despite, you know, you've gone, literally, when we started in boxing, you've gone to like here, yeah? And even though I've gone to here, yeah, you have still stayed humble and you've never, it's never given you, you know, and you, you've enjoyed watching me grow. You've had no bitterness, you've had no chip on your shoulder. You know, all the heights that I've gone to, where sometimes you, you know, you've followed me around, you've been in my slipstream, but you've, but you've sort of kept encouraging me, and a lot of haters don't do that. They see you rock it off, 
to superstardom and they get jealous or they start getting bitter or talking behind my back. Do you know what I mean? You've watched me go to superstardom and you've still be, you know, the fact is, is I, I class you, you're a fan. You know, you're an Eddie Hearn fan. I think that's amazing. I'm joking, by the way. No, you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. You're in the back, but you won't even see it coming because they're so friendly and nice to you. And that's not really for me. I'd rather you just didn't talk to me and I just knew we don't do business. Like, don't get me wrong, if there's a deal to be done, but we don't like each other, let's just be honest about that. But in America, it's, it's really like, hey, Chris, you look amazing. Where really you think, fucking you've put on some weight. Do you know what I mean? I'd rather that. I'd rather someone comes up to me and goes, Eddie, Jesus Christ, Porky, you've put on some timber, rather than, hey, Eddie, you look amazing. Have you been working out? You know? <laughs> that is what it's like, isn't it? Oh, Eddie. You look right, like when I've been on the road for like, I don't know, six weeks. Fucking hell, Ed, you look terrible, mate. You look absolutely fucked. Oh my God, Eddie, you look amazing. Really fresh. You've been to the spa? You had a facial, man? I'm like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You working? I'm working. I'm a boxer. I'm a warrior. I'm a fighter. Oh! Oh! What oh. 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 the oh. fuck? Oh! Hey! Goddamn! Oh! Dedication! Oh. 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 Please, please, fuck right off and apologise to the men. Right? Don't worry about apologising for me. I give months and months of every single. Every single tweet I put out, you've got the Transformer Pajama Brigade. Just like, meow, be shampoo, meow, meow. I said, just wait, wait. Wait your fucking turn and listen and watch. So now you've done it, and I'll tell you something now, else now, right? And it doesn't matter about me, because Dillian Wyatt is a brute, right? For the people that tried to fuck his career, to the people that have affected his career, that have taken his mandatory position away, I'm not even talking about WBC in this statement, I'm talking about the people that caused this whole problem. You are fucked, right? And now the fun begins. So More quotes that he wants seven million. Yeah, but I mean, I want an 11 inch penis. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's true. You know what I mean? You could, what a thing to say. We've offered him three million dollars. You're right. Sorry, mate. Do you understand me, you slag? <laughs>